hello to carry on with the patterns this pattern is very close to the previous one but might sound little confusing to the beginners you know what you have to this time figure out which one is growing uh, big and which one is becoming shrinking which one is becoming small you see this time i have chosen the space printing to be something which is increasing each time that is why i chose limit to be zero and along with this limits upper value which is the upper value is increasing one by one that means first time it will print zero to zero that is one next time it will print from zero to one that is two and in this way space will be one by one more than the previous row and what about the character printing the r which is go going from the end till the beginning if i take c from 0 to r this will mean i am taking c from the beginning till the end for the first row then as r decreases this will mean c is becoming one less in the second row then one less in the third row in this way c is shrinking for the character printing okay and if i look into the lower half note that the lower half portion is this much because the upper half portion is taking care of the full cycle once so the lower half begins with limit being length minus 2 because length minus 1 was the previous rounds total number of spaces now this time in the lower half the space printing should become one less each time with each row limit is expected to reduce so the limit is reducing one by one and the character to be printed is increasing so r is you see an increasing series from one to the length and each time the character printing it is from 0 to first time 1 that means two uh, character at 0 and character at 1 then the next time it is 0 to 2 then 0 to 3 and finally when r becomes the full length the last of the row is from 0 to full length which is the full string okay 